Hi my friends, today we model this part, you'll see what features are here and this is the drawing. This part is uh, number 23 from my collection of 100 parts. We start by creating this contour with a rectangle with corners and some uh, features. Dimensions are here. New empty document. Take a look of this uh, workbench and select CAD, not Bender, because we create uh, mechanical parts. First contour is this uh, rectangle with uh, rounded corners. Dimensions 130, 116, radius 10. New sketch, this plane and rounded rectangle. This is that rounded rectangle. 130, enter, 116, enter, 10, enter. Okay, but where are the dimensions? <laughs> they are here, here, and here. We apply symmetry at this point with this point about this axis. Then we place this line to, to this axis at a distance of 52 plus 30. Close, extrude or pad on 20. New sketch, this plane rectangle dimensions 188 enter 30 symmetry this point this point and this axis also this point, this point, and the other axis. Close, pad, also 20. Okay. <clears throat> Next are these uh, two cylinders their dimension is uh, if we start from here 26 minus 20 the diameter is 74 and the distance 56 this face for a new sketch two circles one two they are equal, their diameters are equal, they are symmetrical placed about this axis, symmetry, uh, diameter is 74 and the distance is 
56. Trim to eliminate this and this. Good. One degree of freedom. Position on vertical. That position is 30 from the center point. Close, extrude or pad. The dimension is 26 minus 20 dimensions in the drawing. Okay. Inside the two are two holes of 56 with a depth of 15. New sketch on this face. Project the two circles. Draw other circles. One, two, this is uh, 46 and the other is uh, equal equal this with this close pocket and the dimension is 15 okay then this cut from here it is 32 with the depth of 26 minus 15. Face, sketch, project, this line and create a rectangle, normal rectangle with dimensions 32, enter, 26 minus 15, okay, close, pocket, all the way through the part. Very nice. Next are these two features. 30, 43 or uh, radius 15 is here. We have in the drawing radius 15 and the dimension of 30. So we use this and not 30 divided by 2. This dimension is in the drawing face sketch project this bottom line then polyline starting from here up vertical then m m m and we go here then another M, M to go to this point and we close with a horizontal. You see this is vertical but here is not the sign of tangency. This means that we have to place tangent between this and this. A new constraint. Dimensions are also constraints this is a constraint of 43 and i don't need to apply this here dimension a radius because this is already projected here close and pad pad to the left not to the right with a thickness of uh, 18 18 
then we apply mirror of this uh, feature we select it this is the, the one and then we apply mirror mirror about this plane what is the plane y z okay good then holes one is this 16 from here through both features and the other are these four holes of 10 in the centers of these uh, four fillets face sketch project circle no matter what diameter is that circle because we apply hole and we place here the diameter of 16 and we also select through all yes okay and then we select this face new sketch project arc 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 and arc four circles no matter what is the diameter any diameter you like you can place here why you know why close and hold all the four are now six by default and we place here ten dimension through all okay that's all for today thanks for watching bye bye